Yeah, interesting decision there by the defence to go under that pick and roll situation on Farmworth. She already hit two. Pays off because she was unable to connect. Nice J in transition there by Blickhubs. Uh, hard to guard. Yeah, high release jump shot there. Spillane in for the Hawks. That's Errant a... pass there by Farnworth to Mahalko. Blickhubs in transition as the Hawks push it back out to seven. Geelong pulling, pulling the trigger hard and quick in offence, still with that focus on the low post, down to Blickhubs, and she is taking over. From that Toy Was Story it? movie, oh, yes. I'm clearly channeling one of the characters. A bit of clearly, buzz, buzz or Woody? No, nah, it's more of a Woody line. A Woody line, okay. Yeah. Yep, clearly, uh, you're not familiar with the movies whatsoever. Looking to help along the baseline there as the entry pass looked to go into Blixarves. Eventually, it does. There's the double from Bone. Blixarves is on fire. And that was nothing but net all with the hands of Rolf. Now, Frank Catasano kicks across. Here is Blickarves, and she buries the three. She's such a high-quality player. The opportunities you create when you're dribbling downhill. Uh, teams are worried about you getting at the rim as we see Blickarves pull up, and she is on fire at the moment. High arcing, kiss off the glass. Now, Kenny was talking about uh, Mahalko's little hook shot slash unbalanced J that you just mentioned there. She's made it her own um, since being in Australia. It's been really effective. So here's Blickarves. Can she turn things around for Geelong? They trail by 14. Three ball. Brian Catizano. Blickarves with a strong rebound. That's the seventh of the contest. Nice finish. Mullings couldn't foul, but it was a good finish from Blickarves.